Hello guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video. So today, we will be looking at the Tameable Hostile Mobs add-on. So in this add-on, you can actually tame hostile mobs, and they will fight for you, they will follow you, and yeah, it's pretty cool. So, there are, I'm pretty sure there are more than I will be showing you, but I will be showing you a few of them. So, let's get into it. So, for the first one here, we have the zombie. It's actually started it tonight. Okay, so night it's night now. So, if you get a zombie, then rot and flesh for this one. You can tame it. And, let's get skeletons here. Any hostile mobs, they'll go ahead and fight those for you. They'll even fight hostile mobs that are the same as them. So as you can see there, they do follow you. So, I'll show you the next one. So the next one is the skeleton. You can tame this one with bones. They will also fight for you. The next one is going to be the spider, so you can tame this one, but what's also special about this one is you can ride it. It's pretty hard to control sometimes, because it still will go in the direction where it wants to, but usually you can control it pretty well. Also, I forgot to mention, when they are tamed, they will have more health than the normal untamed version. So, anyways, the next one is going to be the creeper. I did do another add-on that there is a tameable creeper in. If you want to go check that video out, the link will be in the description. But this one is just the normal Minecraft creepers tameable. He will explode, so you can really only have this one until he explodes, and then he'll be gone until you tame another one. The next one that I have ready is the Evoker. This one is pretty expensive to tame. It will actually take Totem of Dyings, so you'll need you might need to have a few of them if you're going to do it in survival, because it. You don't always tame them on the first time, just like dogs and cats and, yeah. He will still spawn in the vexes that will also fight the other mobs. Next one is going to be the blaze. So once you go to the nether, you're going to have to kill a few of them to get the blaze rods to tame them. But then you can tame them once you have the blaze rods. So this one will of course shoot the fireballs. Then the last one I have to show you is going to be the ghast. 
so this one will be pretty difficult to tame in survival but if you can manage to get to one you'll be able to do it it's even kind of difficult and creative okay I think I have it tamed now so if I go over here it should come to me yeah okay This one, yeah, you have to come here with gas tears. Also, if you're in survival with these, they can still be dangerous if they... For example, the gas in the blaze, they might shoot a fireball at your house or something, or at you by accident. But they won't actually purposely go for you. Also, I did forget to mention that you can name them. And it will say what killed them with their name in the chat. If you don't name them, it will just say the name of the mob and then what it was killed by. So, yeah. Anyways, guys, that is going to be all for this video. So I hope you did enjoy. Remember to like and subscribe if you did. And I will put the link to the other video I was talking about in the description. If you want to go see that, I do suggest that you watch it. It's pretty good with a bunch of new creepers. Um... And you can go watch my other videos as well. And that's all for me. See you in the next video.